Due to lack of options to pick his playing 11 after suspension of four players, Australia have included the available frontline bowlers for the Mohali Test. While Glenn Maxwell failed to retain his place in the side, off-spinner Nathan Lyon made it to the playing 11 alongside Xavier Doherty. Whereas in the pace department, the team management had nothing to choose from, as Peter Siddle and Mitchell Stark were the only available options after Mitchell Johnson and James Pattinson were suspended on disciplinary grounds. Steve Smith benefited from all-rounder Shane Watson's suspension as he made it into the team. After the debacle in the second test, skipper Michael Clark had announced his intention of batting up the order from the usual number 5 position. With Phil Hughes struggling to find feet against the Indian spinners, the Australian skipper is set to bat at number 3. However, Hughes would consider himself lucky as he will get another shot at redemption due to the lack of availability of other players, especially Usman Khawaja. The only major change comes in the form of Matthew Wade who is yet to recover from his injury. Brad Haddon who kept wickets for the team before Wade was called in as a replacement and will be keeping for the Mohali test. After all the controversy that unfolded over the player's suspension, Michael Clark had said that his focus was to regroup with the team and look to win the Mohali test. With a half-strength squad to choose from and day one already washed out, the Australian skipper has a lot to worry about on the field as well as off it. With 2-0 down in the series, the Aussies can only hope to resolve their differences quickly and put up a brave front to avoid a possible series defeat looming large over.